Good afternoon, Mitchell. How about a little walk together with me down memory lane in Black Point? Here we go. Back in time. Toronto, the 1950s. I was a little guy, maybe five years old. Well, first of all, being 13 years older, and with that Austin Healy, you might as well have been James Bond. Here's our proud dad capturing a shot of his little tribe on a vacation in Florida. You, of course, have the front seat with mom. I think I'm seeing a proud dad here with his firstborn son. And why not? What a good looking guy. Hey, Uncle Mickey. I wanted to talk about my favorite memories of you, which of course originate from the cottage. Um, summers at the cottage with you were just the best. And being little and running, waking up in the morning and running over to you and just being so excited to see you every single morning was one of my happiest memories. I also um, remember that you were the one who taught me how to barbecue as a little girl and that's something, a skill that I've taken with me for the rest of my life and I really cherish. So happy birthday, happy 75th, this is a huge deal. I love you so much, I wish I was there to celebrate, but I'm totally there with you in spirit. I love you. A favorite memory of Uncle Mickey I have is every summer at the cottage, he and Auntie Lily would take me and Sierra out, we'd drive into Penetanguishene, and we'd go to the toy store, and we could each pick out one toy and anything we wanted, and it would always become our favorite toy for the summer. And then we'd go out and eat fish and chips. And on the ride home on the windy road, we'd sing James Taylor songs. I hope you have a great 75th birthday, Uncle Mickey. I love you. Mickey, I'm here to wish you the happiest of birthdays. I already have, but you should have your birthday all month um, for this huge event of 75. And I want to say that my uh, fondest memories of you have always been as um, a very generous heart, a very uh, family-oriented person who uh, immediately took me into your family, uh, has loved my girls, has um, just always been a fantastic support, and um, you have so much humor and love, kindness in your heart, and I appreciate it so much. One overriding memory that is with me from my whole life's relationship with you is that you've always been there for me, for my whole experience growing up in Toronto and beyond. You were never, you never failed to be the guy I could turn to for wise advice and just a general calm calming influence on that life was going to work out fine and I really appreciate that made a lasting impression and added a huge solid foundation to my whole life story and I love you so much for that you've been a great big brother and I just can't say how happy I am for you and your family and what a great life you've made for yourself Big hugs and hope to see you soon. Bye.